Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming to you live from Hermosa Beach, California. We're back home from Chicago. Thanks to everybody who uh, who checked in with us, who said hello, and who supported us through the national and uh, and beyond, and before and beyond. 2020, 2021 Panini Select Basketball. This is a four box pick your team break number 13 from the website jazbeescasebreaks.com. A very big thank you to all of these wonderful people for getting in on the action. There you go. Thanks, everybody, for making this happen. So breaks 13, 14, and 15 are all from the same case. Thanks. And Miles had that triple last spot mojo about the last three teams. That's why he has that star next to his name. And here's the case of select, fresh case. Now, this dropped while we were at the National, and, gosh, there was a lot of, uh, a lot of buzz about it, I think, at the National. A lot of people... A lot of breakers around me were breaking it, and there seemed to be a lot of uh, a lot of satisfied customers. I know some people were a little bummed that, that maybe a hobby gets watered down a little bit because of all the retail that's coming out with Select, but that might be more academic because I feel like I feel like uh, from the from the ground level, no one really cared. They were really happy about Select and the quality of it. And everyone's having fun with it, which is what, which is the whole the whole point of this, having fun. All right, so we got the dice right here. One, two, three for the left six and four, five. No, we're doing four box breaks, my bad. I was doing six box half cases at the National. So here's four right there. You can see me stack the four right here. Here's a stack of four right here. Here's another stack of four right there. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six on the dice roll. Three. One, two, three, four. And here's five, six. So let me just mark these boxes so we all know they're from the same case. The national was a lot of fun. Once again, thanks to everybody who who bought spots in our national breaks. We still have the when those national breaks come back from. Uh, Come back from Chicago at the end of the week. We'll finish those breaks off and then give and do the big giveaway too. And I'm sure we could run another four boxes back later tonight. But yeah, the national was a lot of fun. So thanks everybody once again for the support. It was lovely to see all the all the people at the national. Uh, some familiar names in the chat, finally seeing them in person, like Mac. Like Mac McCarthy, saw him. He's got a buddy that, that is with CPD. Thinking about contacting some of the big auction places in work security, yeah. Um, I think more and more people, more and more uh, booths and from those major auction houses are increasing their security. It's Hobby, a lot, lot of, lot of, a uh, lot of attention on the hobby in the last couple of years or so. TJ saying that speaking of retail, some of your Walmart closest to you has put cards back on the shelves. Tons of Contenders football and Mega Chronicles football. All right. Well, check your local uh, WalMarts or Targets and see, and let me know if, uh, let me know if anyone's seeing the same. This is Pick Your Team 13. All the random teams are on the Mad Max truck coming back from Chicago and rolling through the, uh, rolling through the west and the southwest and coming back to California. So all the random teams will do when they come back. All right, we're going to lead off with Draymond Green. And we got Devin Vassell, 46 out of 199, jersey and autograph. A little, little dark right here. We got the sunlight blasting through here, so. But you can see what we got there. Devin Vassell going to the Spurs. That'll be for Miles. That's one of his last spot mojo teams. There you go, Miles. Last spot mojo, 70% of the time. Hits 100% of the time. Got Damian Lillard. Gosh, I, I don't know if I could keep track of all the uh, of all the changes in the NBA, folks. In 
all these trade grades. We got 54 out of 99, Derek Coleman. Lime green, old New Jersey Nets. This will go to Brooklyn, Shane, with the Nets. Yeah, we did have the, yeah, I was closer to the entrance there. You can kind of see it in the window behind me. But that, that just shows mo most of the, the shop floor. Oh yeah, remember that crash? Yeah, there was a truck that ran into a pole. The power pole across the street from us. Thankfully, we weren't on the same grid, so we were all right. There's Grant Riller, rookie tricolor for Charlotte. That'll be for Gary. And in Fuego, Luca Doncic. I think these inserts are pretty, pretty short printed. I think Darren was reminding me when this first came out. It's pretty cool. Silver rookie silver, Vernon Carey Jr. Some Giannis. And a die cut, Sadiq Bay, rookie die cut for the Pistons, 249. Um, ben saying weather in Cali not awesome in August. It's pretty awesome, at least in at least by the beach. Here in Hermosa Beach, California, it's pretty nice. At a uh, what time is it right now? At 5.37 in the afternoon, 71 degrees. It's a little toastier when you go inland closer to like Staples Center and stuff like that, but it's pretty nice along the coast. It's RJ Hampton, rookie silver. Cole Anthony. Rookie tricolor for Orlando. That's going to be for EA. And a Denny Avija silver for Mark B and the Wizards. Concourse edition. Ooh, and a nice Anthony Edwards courtside. It's the base courtside, but the courtside level, the courtside tier is the uh, shortest printed one. It's for Jimmy and the T Wolves. There's a uh, Capazzo to one at ninety nine for Denver. That's going to be for Shane. Another Anthony Edwards and a precious Achua piece of his jersey heading out to Miles in the Heat. Another one of his. Last spot mojo team. So two of his three last spot mojo teams have hit 70% of the time. 100% of the time. And this Anthony Edwards is the premier level. Premier? Premier? It's to 149 on the Theo Maladon. Dan with the Thunder. Isaac Okoro back here as well for the Cavs. All right, box one in the books, one of four. Uh, another four box break is uh, is in the store right now. And I think we're actually pretty close to knocking out another one of those. I think Pick Your Team 14 is down to five. Down to five teams left. That'll be, uh, if you're watching live, that'll be Nets, Cavs, Heat, Trailblazers, and San Antonio Spurs. You can pick your teams right there. Now basketball, lots of crazy things happening. Bulls land Lonzo Ball for 85 million bucks. They get Alex Caruso for 37 million dollars. Mike Conley staying with the Jazz on a three-year deal. Knicks to re-sign Burks and Noel as well. Cavs retain center Jared Allen on a five-year hundred million dollar deal. I like Jared Allen's game. 
Mavs keep Hardaway with a four-year deal. Nugs, Nuggets keep Barton and give Jeff Green a two-year deal. Heat and Jimmy Butler moving forward with a max deal. The Heat at, also added Kyle Lowry. CP3 staying with the Suns. He got extended for a little bit. What else is happening here? kind of wish I, Lakers were able to afford to keep Alex Caruso, but alas, no. Nicholas Batum agreeing to return to the LA Clippers two-year deal. Derek Rose agreeing with a three-year deal to return to the Knicks. Evan Fournier returning to the Knicks four-year deal. Solomon Hill one-year deal with the ATL. This is all Woj, Wojness from today, going from most current to oldest. Solomon Hill one-year deal with the Hawks. Dwight Howard returning to LA. Lakers for his third stint with the Lakers. Never should have let him go last year. I don't know what happened last year. Trevor Ariza back with the Lakers. Trevor Ariza, I feel like, was always a fan favorite. Um, so glad to have him back. Mike Muscala, two-year deal with OKC. Zach Collins, three-year deal with the Spurs. Gary Trent Jr., three-year deal to return to the Raptors. Uh, Korkmaz, who's a great off-the-bench three-point guy. Three-year, $15 million. Reggie Bullock agreeing, a deal, agreeing to deal with the Mavs. Boban Marjanovic back with the Mavs. Mo Harkless, two-year deal with the Kings. Uh, Sterling Brown, this is just more for me now. Sterling Brown, two-year deal with the Mavs. Jeff Green, two-year deal with the Nuggets. Doug McDermott, three-year deal with the Spurs. Chris Paul, once again, uh, opted out and then re-signed for another four-year deal. Right there, Torrey Craig, Pacers. Duncan Robinson, five years, to stay, five years 90 to stay with the Heat. Um, TJ McConnell. Four-year, 35, to stay with the Pacers, so on and so forth. Any other bigger news that I missed here? The Bulls deal for the for Lonzo is four years, 85, in a sign and trade. So yeah, it's crazy. And I still think the Lakers, who are reconstructing their team a little bit, I think they're still interested in maybe trying to get Buddy Heald from the Kings on some sort of sign and trade with Dennis Schroeder, but I don't know if they want Dennis Schroeder. Nice Obi Toppin rookie jersey and auto. Knicks. Sean O'Leary with the Knicks. So I think um, so I think they're still trying to get that, but they may need to get a third team involved if they could land Buddy Heald. Sean O with the Knicks. There's Tim Hardaway Jr. Resigned. Extension. James, James uh, I almost said Jameis. No, James. Not James Winston, but James Weissman. Uh, rookie premier level for Golden State. That'll be for Sean O. And in Fuego, Donovan Mitchell, Utah Jazz. That'll be for Jose Arias and the Jazzy Jazz. And we got a silver Obi top in premier level. Nice. That's for Sean O and the New York Knicks. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of money in basketball. A lot of above average to above average guys getting getting paid. Yeah, I, I guess supply and demand. There's just not not too many. You know, rosters aren't very big in basketball. Hachimura Silver. There's a Patrick Williams, another James Weissman, and a Gerald Green, 63 out of 99. Rockets, in-flight autograph, Serenity with Houston. Jeremy saying that his Pacers are coming for everyone, or, or not. All right, see you, Jesse. Thank you. Rookie Silver, Cole Anthony. That'll be for Orlando. That's going to go to EA. Nice. Concourse Silver. Zion Courtside. For the Pelicans, that'll be for Sean O. And we got a Joel Embiid die cut to 249. Malachi Flynn. Rookie silver for Toronto, Mark. There's the die cut for 
the Sixers. It's going to be for Gary. Darren Poor saying, if I was a team owner or a GM, you would just sign a bunch of D-League guys. They can ball too. It's tricky because I, I think that, that, yeah, regular season, I think if you're a sharp GM, regular season, you could probably get away with a good scouting department. You could probably get away with getting some D-League guys in there, finding a lot of value. But I think once you get to the playoffs, that's where... That's where a bulk of these guys are, are making their money, or should be. That's where they should be earning their paychecks. There's Onyeka Okongwu. Nice gold parallel. Steven Olsen, Atlanta Hawks. One out of ten, the first one ever made. It's pretty good, too. There's a John Morant courtside for Memphis. That's going to be for Brian. There's Boyan Bogdanovich. 64 out of 149 for the Jazz. Jose with Utah. Yeah, Jeremy's just happy that McConnell's coming back. There's LeBron. RJ Hampton to 199. There's Sabonis and Udoka. This is the last year. At some point, some products will have, uh, will have his new jersey number right. This might be the last year for that jersey number in upcoming basketball products. All right. Halfway through this four-box break, here's box three. What else? Did I miss any other big free agency news? What's your, what is your team, everyone? And, and are you happy with the moves or lack of moves? Happy, unhappy? Or do you feel... Where, where do you land on all this? For my Lakers, I'm pretty happy with... Cautiously happy. Cautiously optimistic about, about, the, uh, about the Lakers. I think, like I said, I've been saying this all week, that all the moves the Lakers make won't matter unless Anthony Davis is 100% in both the regular season and the playoffs. We're close to it. Can't miss really too many games especially the playoffs, so I think the key was really around Anthony Davis, so hopefully he'll be, if he can, if he can do that, then, you know, then the lack of, quote-unquote, the lack of shooters around, like, LeBron and Ru Russell Westbrook won't really matter all that much. Defensively, Anthony Davis is super important. But Anthony Davis is really the key, you know, and that'll that'll allow LeBron James to kind of, you know, be able to not use him as much throughout the regular season, keep him fresh for the postseason. And it starts with Anthony Davis, so hopefully he's working on that. But Westbrook is interesting. Dwight Howard coming back is a good backup for, for Anthony Davis, so hopefully that should help alleviate some uh, some of the regular season grind, some of that pressure off of him. Ooh, a Magic Johnson one of one autograph? Woo! Magic Johnson, he's a magic man. Sean O'Leary with the Lakers gets the one of one Magic Johnson autograph. That is sharp. That is nice. Our first train whistle of the day and after coming back from the National. Sean O'Leary all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Nice. And there's AD, speaking of Anthony Davis. There's an Anthony Edwards. We got a Desmond Bain insert. Yeah, we'll see how the rest of the Lakers line up. A little, little in, yeah, interested on how Westbrook is going to fit in with the Lakers team. There's Kyle Lowry, Raptors, 21-25, making his move to the Heat. Love this tie-dye, though, for Toronto. Mark. There's a 
is a LeBron James tricolor. But I think uh, I think Westbrook will play well with the other with his other teammates. I don't think that's going to be too much of an issue. I think he's only had to be a focal point of offense because he well because he had to be you know to take to shoulder the offensive burden. But he doesn't have to do that. Make him a more well balanced player. Emmanuel quickly silver for the Knicks. That will be for um, for Sean O. Obi top and courtside also going to Sean O. Rex, what's going on? No, that hockey is not uh, busted open yet. If you click the link that Nightbot just dropped, and there's always a schedule in the chat. If you click that, you'll see the exact time or estimated time on when we're going to do that break. More Knicks. Obi Toppin. Piece of his jersey. Anthony Edwards premier level for the T-Wolves, Jimmy. Is it next? It might be next. I don't know. Whatever the schedule says. I need this I need the schedule just as much as you guys. Now, what, what did I say? Lakers were looking at Buddy Heald, right? Buddy Heald would look pretty good on this team. Westbrook, Buddy Heald, LeBron, Anthony Davis. Dwight Howard. Hopefully, they, if they re-sign THT, it would be, be pretty cool, too. Sadiq Bay red to 199. I mean, is this guy going to get moved? Is Ben Simmons going to be traded? That'll be interesting to see. Sadiq Bay will go to the piston. That's for Roy. That will be that that piston scene could be interesting, Roy. It's Eric Pascal, because they they're adding that they're adding uh, the number one overall pick, Cade Cunningham, who could be a franchise changing changing player, surrounded by some solid players, some solid youngsters that the Pistons have drafted, with a couple additions here and there. You know, the Pistons could be could be ahead of schedule. Speaking of the Pistons, there's Sadiq Bey, piece of his jersey. All right, I think Sadiq Bey's still on there. Um, there's Andrew Brewster, Pistons fan, and I'm happy. Got another shooter for Kate. Yeah, I, I mean, and Isaiah Stewart, I think, was, had looked pretty good, too. Um, so they've got some interesting youngsters. They added Kelly Olenek. Let's look at their death chart right there for a few years. Right. So this is an interesting team. Think about this. Killian Hayes, Cade Cunningham, Sadiq Bey, Jeremy Grant, right? Isaiah Stewart, good young player. They've got some, some interesting youngsters. You know, if they develop some of these young guys over the next couple years, watch them grow, spend a little money on some free agents, Cade Cunningham could be like the sort of emerging superstar. Watch him develop over the next handful of years. Right. Could be interesting. All right. Fourth and final box, pick your team number 13. Big thanks to everybody who got into the action. Rex is saying, yeah, I noticed that, Rex, yeah. Switching to baseball really quick. Uh, Rex is saying all, all three of the, the ex-Cubs hit home runs in their debut. Did Chris Bryant end up hitting a home run in his debut too? I know Rizzo and Baez did. And you're saying three, so Chris Bryant must have. The Giants. He did. Speaking of Chicago, Bulls are interesting too, right? I like the Lonzo edition. They've been working, Lonzo's been working on a shot. It looked a lot better last year, so maybe you can keep that up this year. They got Alex Caruso, who I really like. He's great, versatile. 
intense, can play some defense. Zach Levine's still there. Patrick Williams still growing. They got Vucevic from last year. You know, so... So, a couple other moves here and there. Could be really nice. That's right, yeah. Seiko Dumboya, going back to the Pistons. Seiko, he's still around. A lot, a lot of interesting things happening. Here's our first Lamelo. And a silver Cole Anthony Premier Edition. It's going to be for EA and the Magic. And our first LaMelo Ball Concourse Edition going for Gary. Going to Gary. It's for Gary and the Charlotte Hornets. Hopefully we can find a few more before we close out this box. There's Bradley Beal. Piece of his jersey going to Mark and the Wizards. And all these cards will ship, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, you know, the Pistons also have Pistons also have Josh Jackson, who I think was playing okay. He kind of washed out with the sun. Here's Patrick Williams, speaking of. Autograph, nice. We did not, Kevin. We still have to finish off the rest of those national breaks, which are coming back from the Mad Max truck at the end of the week. It's barreling down the highway from Chicago, coming back to here, coming back here to LA, on the bottom of the website, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Eighty-one out of ninety-nine on that Patrick Williams. Lime green for Sean T. and the Bulls. Yeah, so Josh Jackson's okay. Diallo, it's fine. They got some depth too. Saban Lee, Dennis Smith Jr., Frank Jackson. And a tie dye to 25. Courtside, Bradley Beal. 21 out of 25. That's nice. Mark with the Washington Wizards. Bradley Beal, maybe on the is he on the move? Where where is he gonna end up? Does he stay with Washington? Steph Curry, scope. There's Killian Hayes, more Pistons. That's for Roy. Alexi Pokusevsky for OKC for Dan Tricolor rookie Tricolor. James Weissman, Joel Embiid Silver, Joel Embiid Courtside. Steph Curry white parallel to one forty nine for Golden State Sean O. Got Aaron Naismith rookie Tricolor for Boston. That'll be for Karen. Kelvin Johnson, die cut to 175 for the Spurs, Miles. CJ Elby, rookie silver for the Trailblazers. And Kendrick Nunn in the back right there. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was 2021 Panini Select Basketball, four box, third of a case. Pick your team, number 13. Uh, from a, this, The first four boxes from a fresh case. So we still have the second third and the final third to go on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Let's fill it up. Let's make it happen. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye.